In this lesson, we are going to work with 2D shapes and block diagrams. We will build code that allows the user to change the size of the blocks by inputting different values. We are going to start by writing code that lets the user set the variable width by inputting different values. The unit used for the width is pixels. The program will ask for an input when the button is clicked. We'll then use this code to change the width of a square. See what happens when you click on the button a few times and input different values. We can write similar code to allow the height to be set to different values. To make a block diagram later, we want to make sure the block expands in the right direction when we change the height and width. So we need to learn how to align it. Try to make it follow the grey shape. Aligning it to the left will make it expand to the right. And aligning it to the bottom will make it expand upwards. Now it's time to make a block chart. We are going to do a survey and ask how many people have tiger as their favourite animal. We are going to start by bottom aligning the red rectangle so that it expands upwards and setting the block size to 32 so that we can build up the chart block by block. When we click on the red square, the program should ask the user for a value and adjust the height by the value times the block size. Then, we can add more animals and more blocks to our diagram. Which animal is your favourite? 